So now we are going to arrange and print. Let's say this is the same case we have done working on from our previous lecture. So this can be your first page. Right, so we copy this, copy selection, put there. The second page is the notes. We will go through it and see the notes that you want them to have. Concrete grade, you will put your concrete grade, the steel grade, you all put them, and all these notes, you go through them. Copy this second page, and the third page is your foundation layout. Copy this, go to where you did it, copy selection. bring it in here okay so the next page is your basis if you like you change these names before you start editing copy selection drop here then Pick your bases. You drop here. I want. Let's see. Move it this side. Let's see if you can put all of them. But if you print and you see that it's tiny, you can separate them. And the next next page of the selection the next page can be your columns copy the columns if this is big you copy selection scale it in the middle you can type 0 0.6 good it is still big for you and I can scale this 0 0.8 I can still scale it 0 0.9 nothing is okay if it has not this page, I'll copy selection. The next, the next page now can be your beam layout, beam and slab layout. Scale, and increase it. Come and pick my be my slab layout copy selection too small let me see scale it 1.2 copy selection And then the next page before here you can put your move up small you can put your staircase here too small
move all this So now we put our beams. Okay, one point five. Copy selection. Not enough. One point two. all of them then you pick another one copy selection okay zero point six think that's okay You can write the as you are doing your writing the title here. This one is top reinforcement. You can write top reinforcement top reinforcement detail. I also put it here if you want. So the last one can be a roof being detail. If it's going to have parapet, you can use this as your parapet detail. So, you write it, roof beam detail. Yeah, beam reinforcement detail, you write. Yeah. Floor being layout, slab, slash, beam, layout. You can write first. First floor. So when you write stickers detail column detail basis foundation layout notes cover so when you arrange this usually I convert them to AutoCAD if I print so how do I do that I'll come to plot as it is like this I'll come here, I'll choose DWG to PDF and I'll choose a let's say ISO A3 depends ISO A ISO A3 the first one center plot which I center 
is landscape as displayed none then I'll come to window then I'll select this to here preview right click plot so I'll come and save where I'm doing the where I'm doing the work cover I can write structure zero the cover before you do that you will name this sheet how oh, was one this one was two three so I'll do the same thing for all the pages but how good if you come here the next time now see all this setting if you like we use last plot you take the settings of the last plot then you click here you see window preview right right click click on plot I write this s3 depending serially you follow it serially until You finish this dot S whatever the S twelve. So if you now go to where you saved it, you should be able to see it in the folder that you you saved it so see them here so you can now be able to print your pdf or send it for review and do the rest okay thank you for watching